And Jain Sinha said that the government is working on the extradition of liquor baron Vijay Malia from Britain, who is on the run after owing more than 9,000 crores to the banks. Sinha also added that good monsoons will revive the country's growth to over 8%. Listen in. We have filed for extradition. Uh, it is a lengthy legal process uh, that has to uh, be approved by uh, the UK judicial system. Uh, on our end, we will uh, do everything we possibly can and uh, hopefully we will be able to uh, enable him to face justice here in India. The monsoon has uh, made landfall. It is uh, now over Kerala and the southern parts of Tamil Nadu, uh, which is, of course, for the economy, very good news. Uh, it's a week late, but just in Hindi, mein kehte hai, Der aay par durust aay. Uh, to we are hoping very much that we will have uh, even a normal monsoon, uh, even though the predictions are that we could have uh, a better than normal monsoon. But even a normal monsoon uh, will be very important for the economy. If we have a normal monsoon, we should uh, have GDP growth rate uh, over 8%. Uh, as you know, in the last quarter, we had a quarterly growth rate of 7.9%, uh, and with even a normal monsoon, uh, we should be able to exceed that quite comfortably. It's been a tremendous success on many fronts. Uh, obviously, as far as diplomacy and national security is concerned, it's been a great success. But as far as the economy and business issues are concerned, it's also been a great success. Uh, it seems uh, American businesses are uh, continuing to invest in India. Uh, in, uh, in a very uh, uh, accelerated way. Uh, Amazon has committed more money to India. And so I think we'll continue to strengthen our business linkages with America. Okay, that's Jayantina. But moving on, Prime Minister uh, 